morning. My name is Vlad. I'm a recovered alcoholic and drug addict. How are you doing today? I'm going to read from your daily journey with God. May 26th, The Boiling Frog. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, walks about like a roaring lion, seeking whom he may devour. And that's 1 Peter 5, verse 8. Most people have heard the boiling frog metaphor. If you drop a frog into a pot of boiling water, it will frantically try to jump out. But place the frog in a pot of room temperature water, then slowly heat the water, and the frog will get used to the change in temperature and slowly succumb to the boiling water. While factually incorrect, the metaphor is useful for pointing out the danger of complacency and inattention. This metaphor could well be used to warn residents of the earth about the slow rise to power of the Antichrist. Seen first as a savior by brokering peace between Israel and her enemies, this man of sin will ultimately consolidate world power and authority by threatening to punish those who do not acquiesce to his demands. By the time he is established on the world stage, it will be too late to stop him. Jesus spoke often of the signs of the times. It behooves us to be alert and watchful as God's end time plans take shape. Indeed, keep your eyes open. The best way to avoid the terrible reign of the Antichrist is to be absent from the earth, safely at home with the Lord. 1 Thessalonians 4, verses 13 through 18. A wandering heart needs a watchful eye. And that's a quote by Thomas Watson.